In news just coming in, Minister of State for External Affairs Shashi Tharoor has reacted to the spate of attacks against Indian students in Australia, saying very clearly that the repeated attacks on Indians show there is in fact a component of racism involved. Remember, that is a charge that Australian authorities have constantly been denying, saying they could be opportunistic crimes. Shashi Tharoor has also said that the onus of giving security to Indians clearly lies with the Australian government. The government of India has made its views very clearly known to the government of Australia and the government of Australia in turn has declared its determination to deal firmly with the perpetrators of this kind of activity. So we are feeling quite conscious of the fact that this is taking place on the territory of a friendly country which has its own responsibilities to the well-being not only of its own citizens but of those who are coming there to study and we leave it to the Australian government to do what is right. Obviously, whatever our High Commission and consulates can do, they are doing. And they are always there to provide sustenance and, and, and help and counselling to our, to our students. But ultimately, the security of an Indian student on Australian soil is the responsibility of the government of Australia. Now, the Minister of State External Affairs' uh, comments uh, come at a time when there has been one more attack on an Indian in Australia, taking the number to over 20. This time, it's a Sikh student who was attacked for wearing a turban. What's worse is that while even the Australian media has branded the latest attack as racially motivated and admitted that it's a racist attack, the government of the land continues to remain unaffected.